Hey everybody, Kevin Thatcher, the owner of Independence Title over here in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And I wanted to just produce a quick video just talking about obviously this worldwide pandemic that we have going on, COVID-19, the coronavirus. And just to give you some tips and some of the things that I'm seeing around here, because people are calling me every day asking me what's going on. Uh, as you know, we do have a very large title company and we employ many people and we're always getting the same questions over and over again. So I figured why not let's just produce a little video just to give you a little bit of insight, some of the things we're seeing, some of the things we're doing to, to combat what's going on here and, and how together as a real estate community we are going to uh, get through this like with everything we do. So I wrote some notes here, so I am gonna just look at them a little bit. Um, but you know, we, we are closely monitoring the uh, federal government, the CDC, the local authorities, the, the states, the county. We're, we're really monitoring all of the guidelines uh, of, of everyone that they're putting out just to kind of see like, what are the things we can do differently in this business? Uh, yes, our, uh, we're open for closings. We are definitely open, our business is open, we're operating, we are having a very good week. Lots of people wanna close on deals, lots of new buyers are entering into contracts, sellers want to sell their property. So it hasn't really trickled down into our industry yet. Do we see it flattening out a little bit? Do we see a little bit lighter of, of a market? Yes, we do. Uh, but it's just a matter of time as they start closing some of the uh, restaurants and, and, and businesses in town, we're going to see the spending tighten up a little bit. But for right now, people are still trying to close deals. Interest rates, we know we're at an all time low last week. Uh, they creeped up a little bit this week into the fives. They were down in the threes and everybody locked in those rates. They got in their income and, and asset information into the lenders and they are starting to close deals. So uh, one of the things people say is, well, what are you doing about closings? And, and you know, we have always since last year implemented remote online notarization and e-signing. So for those clients that don't want to come into the office, uh, we have an option for you. You can do what's called remote online notarization as long as you have a valid identification from the United States where they do, they do like a, a credit check uh, to ask, ask you some security questions and you are able to fully online do your closing and then for the buyers that would like to e-sign we have that feature available for you as well so you do not have to even come to the closing the one caveat is there are a lot of lenders that have not hopped on board with this yet so if you're doing a closing with a lender we do need to check with them and make sure they're set up for remote online notarization we did have a lender package yesterday that we closed and there were no worries to get it done so you know we do have to check with your lender but if you're doing a cash deal buyers and sellers can all close remotely and you do not even need to come to the office so let's talk about the office what are we doing here at independence title to combat the virus and make sure it's clean well we are educating our staff our clients our family every single day on different things we can do we do sanitize the office three times a day so we stop work and we sanitize three times a day we wipe down all of our workstations we wipe down all of the uh, common area so it's just some things that we can do just to make sure we stop the spread of the virus we are also offering hand sanitizer to every client that comes in they get to leave with a little gift of hand sanitizer to make sure not only is clean title vital but we want to make sure your health is uh, vital as well and make sure that you're staying healthy and clean out there once you leave the office you know, remote access, people have always asked, well, are you working from home? Are you closed? Right now, our office is open. Uh, we have not been told we need to close yet. We are here, we are closing deals, so we can't necessarily close the office when the banks are open, the lenders are open, and buyers and sellers are looking to close deals. So we are here, we are working. Uh, to get these deals closed as quick as possible. Should we need to close, we are able, we do have a cloud system, we are able to log in remotely if we need to work from home. But as I always tell people, once we're home, there's no closings, there's no fundings taking place. So it's very difficult to uh, work remotely unless we move the complete operation to our house. But that means then you'd have to come to my house to close the deal and pick up your check. So as long as the banks are open and businesses are open, we are here serving our local community. We have postponed our event. So for those of you that saw, we were doing our self-defense event and some of our local real estate investment club meetings and our real estate training meetings. We have suspended all meetings for right now until this passes. And once this passes, we will get things rescheduled. Obviously we had events booked at venues and stuff. We did have to cancel the food and the venues and all that. So we will reschedule once we get over the curve here and uh, figure out what we can do to get those events back out to you. 
Social distancing, again, is very important. You know, it's very scary out there to see what's going on. Just make sure you proper practice hygiene. Stay away from people. You know, don't go to your local gym, your local restaurant and, and sit down. Just try and stay as isolated as possible. You may be carrying it. Someone you know may be carrying it. Someone in the local area to where you are may be carrying it and showing no signs. So it is very important you just practice social distancing. Our staff are not on top of each other. We are keeping our distance at our workstations and wiping things down as often as possible. So you wanna do the same while you're out there. You wanna make sure you do not get this virus because if you get it, you're gonna wind up spreading it to other people. So just practice proper social distancing, stay away from people and just go from work to home and back to work. And if you're feeling sick, if your family members are stealing, feeling sick, stay home like we tell everyone else, just stay home. As with everything, you know, this too will pass. I was uh, in this business in uh, at 9-11, most of you know I was a firefighter and moved down from New York just 20 days before September 11th and got into a new business. So I suffered through 9-11, which lasted a much shorter period of time for the real estate market. I suffered through the 2008-2009 um, crash that we had and this too will pass this is just going to be a short time that we need to stop the virus spreading and then we will get back to normal we have an opportunity to get back to normal uh, quicker sooner than later if you practice proper hygiene and social distancing so that's the reason we're doing this stuff and putting out all of these messages but as I wrote in my book I made it through the 2008-2009 crash uh, I suffered through it it was very bad and I wrote a whole book about it called rescue your business there are many chapters in there that do pertain to uh, coming out of things like this so I encourage you to pick up the book if you'd like me to mail a copy you can always write me a message on on social media and I'll be happy to drop a copy in the mail to you uh, free of charge because I want to make sure that that everyone gets through this as best as possible. It's in everyone's best interest to make sure we come out on top uh, and, and, and survive this. People are being laid off, businesses are closing, uh, people are losing income, uh, you know, people are not able to make their payments already, and we're only a couple of weeks into this major pandemic uh, part of it. So we wanna make sure we get in, get out, and now come out on top of everything. So some of those tips and tricks you can learn in the book uh, will be very, very important. So I encourage you to pick up a copy of that. And then the last is, you know, obviously for, from my family to yours, we, we remain committed to this, committed to the process of making sure that we're going to come out of this, uh, you know, the same, as strong as we were when we went in. It's, it just gives us the uh, ability to do everything our can. Our staff is here, you know, all of our employees, both here and, and our, our remote employees are here working as hard as we can to make sure we're keeping this industry moving uh, because we know this too will pass. So if you have any questions, as always, put some comments below. I'd love to answer your questions. We're going to put this all out on social media. Hopefully this video uh, gave you some information uh, of quality for you that you're going to be able to maybe change something that you're doing so we make sure we come out stronger than we went in. So as always, my name is Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO here at Independence Title. And as always, I look forward to seeing you at the closing table. Have a great day and stay safe. Mm -hmm.